Go. All right, so we're gonna go over a BJJ hack today. Um, the evolution of the guillotine in old school, like 20 years ago when I first started doing jujitsu, it was grab the wrist, come up and you pull and you have a squeeze from this side and this side and you use the, bo the bottom of your armpit to fold somebody over and those guillotines still work and they're great but you're just doing so much more work. Then we had Marcelo Garcia come in and he was teaching how to do the high elbow pull here. And as he got better and better with it, that grip started turning and turning to where we were looking at an S grip to where we can get the high elbow pull and the fold over the back. When we folded over the back, it actually pulled the guillotine higher up into the choke. When I drop my elbow, the hand goes up. So now where we were, spent so much time worrying about the squeeze, it's more about the lift, right? Then Ben Eddy came in, awesome 10th Planet guy, and he came in with that okay grip or what he calls a hook grip, where we put these fingers inside that, almost like a rock climber climbing a ledge. It's super strong. Then you can get a much tighter guillotine choke, and that's the evolution of that. So now let's go into where we're talking about um, baseball bat chokes for no gi. Instead of using material, they had to use your hands. You had people usually doing gable grips and trying to bring this elbow across the chest and bring it together. And it's kind of hard because just the positioning of your hands. So then they started working these S grips where they're coming through like this, and now it's a lot easier to bring the elbows together, but once again, you have weird hand positioning. So where we have that okay grip that Ben Eddy uses for his guillotine chokes, now we're gonna evolve that and use that for our baseball bat chokes. So now I have that okay grip, and I find the ledge with those three fingers, now it's much easier to close it down here. So for example, if Scott's laying down for side control, now all I have to do from this uh, side control here is make an okay grip with my hands and then I'm just gonna come underneath his armpit and insert the three fingers right into that ledge right there. And now instead of moving the north-south to get the baseball back choke, all I have to do, drop this hand for a second, is drop this elbow down his shoulder here and now my arm's directly under my chest so when I drop all my weight into this arm, I complete the choke through there. So now from a normal side control, I'm just making that hook grip or okay grip that Ben Eddy uses. For a guillotine, we're gonna use it for our baseball bat choke. So now I come in here, back of my hand slides down, finds the ledge, then I close it up and sit into it for the baseball bat choke. There's our BJJ hat.